in today's video i'll be showing you how i achieved this soft makeup look keep on watching welcome back to my channel if you're new ensure that you hit the subscribe button and if you are a returning subscriber welcome and thank you so much for tuning in so as you can see i already did my brows now i'm just applying foundation to my face my forehead contouring my chin and also i went in with my concealer under my eyes on my forehead and on the bridge of my nose I'm going in with my brush I'm just tapping and blending everything in first I started with the foundation when I finish with the foundation I'm going to move on to the concealer here I'm just adjusting my brows don't mind the short smile <laughs> I was listening to comment the while I was recording this video that's why you see me smile and you're going to see a little bit more of that in the video I'm just tapping on blending blending everything in making sure that everything is even now I'm applying a bit more concealer to my nose and I'm going back in with the beauty blender to blend in you need to blend to ensure that everything is well blended because the key to making your makeup look flawless is to blend very well so I'm just blending in to ensure it looks natural I know this is makeup but you have to blend to a point where it looks like is coming out of your skin if you feel you need a bit more product feel free to apply like you saw me do i just apply a bit of concealer under my eye because i felt i needed a bit under my eye so now i'm just going to set my concealer in place with translucent powder and a brush i'm using a brush The reason you want to set your concealer is because you don't want creasing under your eye. I'm also doing my forehead. I'm applying the translucent powder in all the areas I applied concealer. And also to make those areas brighter on my face. I'm just setting now, I'm setting my foundation with my finishing powder I'm also setting my eyelid as well I'm using a bright powder to set my eyelids now I'm going in with my transition color which is a very light brown color I'm just packing that on my eyelid and I'm going back on both eyes. I'm going back and forth. I'm going in with a with a darker shade. I'm applying that darker shade of brown on my lid and the darker shade of brown I'm using now is like two shades darker than the first transition color that I used. Now I'm just going in into that shimmery kind of purple color and I'm applying that on top of that color on my lower lids. This makeup look is very soft. I wanted something very soft because I was actually going out 
if you have been watching my channel for a while you know that i don't like rainbow looking makeup or eyeshadow most especially when i'm going out i wear colorful eyeshadows when i'm making a video for youtube or on my instagram and by the way if you're not already following me on instagram ensure that you do so my instagram page is absolute makeup p with another p that is my makeup page and if you'd like to follow me on my personal page it's at liarfest now i'm just contouring that's my contour palette i'm applying to my cheekbones then a little bit on my forehead to darken my some areas in my forehead and also i added a, a bit on the sides of my nose just to make my nose look slimmer if you don't you can get away with not really doing anything to your nose for <laughs> it's not that it makes a huge difference but it just gives that slick look to your nose i don't really know how to explain it now i'm just applying blush to my cheekbone on top of that contour that i applied earlier and i'm trying to smile so i could really hit the target areas now i'm just applying my highlighter as you can see that highlighter is a little bit brighter than my skin tone so what i'm doing i'm just touching it slightly with my brush i'm just patting that into my cheeks and also onto my forehead and the bridge of my nose now i just went back into brush at my brow to make them look more soft and now I'm just lining my lip. I'm using this lip pencil. It's a dark brown color. I'm just applying that all over my lip. Now I'm going in with um, a very dark red color onto my lips. Now that I've finished with that, I'm just lining my eyelid with a liner as you can see this makeup is very soft for everyday makeup look this is my usual makeup look like something like this that is very soft though it's not natural but it's very very soft now i'm just applying my lashes I've had these lashes for a while. These lashes are, they are bomb. Like, they are soft, they are light, they are not very thick, and I've used them a couple of times. And this particular one I'm using, I've worn this particular lash over, I think over 10 times. I've worn it over 10 times and I stay in shape, it still looks good. Whenever I clean them, they look as new. And there you have it. Subscribe if you haven't. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it or a thumbs down if you didn't. And also check out my other video on your screen.